trying to connect uh, um, the, the receiver uh, to the to the LNB, uh, the, the, this system, and for that I have prepared two cables. This one will be the longest, the longest one, or the longer one, will be connected uh, to the LNB bas basis, and then uh, to the satellite finder, the side where it's written LNB. Then I will connect this one to that, the adapter. And then from, from the satellite finder, the other side, that has to go to the receiver. I connect this wire, and then the wire will come to your receiver. I'm using this, uh, this uh, manual receiver, sat link, uh, because of the practicability. It's very practical. Uh, otherwise, normally, your, your receiver, the normal decoder, would be located here. Then I connect to the, 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 to the plug that is here. Um, we have to find the position of the satellite we want. Um, if you are using an Android phone, for example, you have two small applications on Android Market uh, or Google Play. Uh, the one, one is SatFinder uh, uh, with a, a dish uh, as, as icon. The other one also is called Satellite Director. These two we will use with also a dish as icon. If I take Satellite Finder and then I make a search there, I'm looking for actually uh, Astra 1, the satellite that is located at uh, 28 degree east. Uh, if I look at the list of satellites that are here, and um, I find, for example, uh, 20, uh, uh, for East 28, I find Eutelsat 28A. Uh, that is at the same position than the Astra I'm looking for. Then I select this one, and since I have given my coordinates, uh, geographic coordinates to the program, and then it has given me here what is azimut? Azimut is one, 110 degrees uh, and the elevation 52.5 degrees. The LNB tilt is 66.2 uh, degrees. So we will try to find that on the dish there. To look for the alignment, uh, the azimut I'm looking for, for the dish alignment. And then I rotate, I rotate my, my plate so that uh, I have this alignment and if you look at the compass here uh, the position that I get now is uh, is uh, one dig one, 110, uh, 110 10 degree I put on my receiver uh, using the sat link um, when it's on you hear I have connected the sat finder between then the LNB and my uh, receiver and I turn the knob so that to have a small uh, volume of, of noise and actually I locate at 5 then I move now my inclination of the dish I have to take the alignment of this bar that you see I have to put this at 50 as I got from my software. Then I will raise this and please listen to the sound of the SAT finder. Sometimes, uh, somewhere it will become sharper than the volume 5 that I had there. Then I, I slowly increase and you see this, this uh, screw moving and the bar going up. And then you see there is a sharp sound there and then I take the position more or less 50 here on the graduation and then you see now if I look at my satellite finder I would see that the volume has increased till somewhere 6 6 I can look for a sharper position by moving look yeah moving up yeah and it's at almost 7 now and if I go further then it decreases. Seven is good. Then I can try to to make a LNB tilt to see whether I get a, a, a higher volume. If I tilt like this, then it's slightly higher than than seven even. 
Uh, I can be sure that I have a satellite position. A, a more likely, it's uh, the one Eutelsat at uh, 28 or Astra at 28 degrees east. So look at this tool. Uh, is I say is normally enough, but you don't have the name of a satellite. Uh, you look for the satellite name in the in the in uh, on the software, and then you find the according to your location, you find. The, the different parameters, the azimuth, the LNB tilt, and also the inclination. That is very easy. Uh, now I will look for this uh, satellite, the, the name, precise name, and the frequency frequencies that are working. So I select the DVBS. I make OK. I go to Quick Search by OK, and then up here on the top, I select on satellite name. I will look for the one that is at 28 degree east. 28 degree east. Uh, I go up, 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 um, up, up, up. 28 degree east. If it is not there, then I have to manually enter this uh, the value of this uh, satellite. Yeah, 282 here. You have Astra 2A, 2B, and 2D. Then I select that one, I go down the LNB type. Uh, instead of normal normal KU, I would take universal. Uh, and I check that uh, uh, the over parameters are okay. Low frequency, high frequency, transponder number, um, the rates uh, at uh, the 22K tone, that's auto here. And the LNB power 13 and the, uh, 18 volt, and that's okay. Um, my um, the satellite longitude is 28.2. All these parameters are okay. Then I press uh, um, okay. I go to the search. I make mute. I auto scan again, and then I wait. Now it has found. Uh, or when I put LNB universal. Uh, with automatic uh, switch between 22k and tres, tre, uh, 13 volt and 18 volt, um, it has it has been going now for a while. And any time the lock uh, indicator is becomes uh, a blue, uh, it it has found satellites. Uh, currently, we have a number of uh, 24 that has been found, and you have, for example, Al Madina CCTV nine. Uh, you have uh, Bushness. Uh, Business uh, 24, CCTV F, CCTV News, uh, uh, CC, CCA Africa, and you have uh, a certain list of radio also is here, RFI multi, multi languages, uh, and, and so forth. Blue, then it will add, and now I have 39 satellites, among which, yeah, again. I have 49. Blue again. Yeah. And blue again. And it will add more satellites to the list. And finally, I have 51. And then here. It's the first one that will be displayed immediately at the position of the program Vox Africa. Vox Africa. And you can move in between the programs, you can move between them by just pressing the triangle at the bottom here. Or at the top, this is Vox Africa, you go at the top, NHK Word SD. Over the past, TV Africa, Wolf TV. Some are uh, are locked. Yeah, many are free. Free to air programs. This is French 24. TV. French 24 in English. 21 BVN. Israeli Chan, that is locked. Yeah, you have TV5 Mond. 48 DW. 
Maestro TV. So a lot of uh, three uh, channels here at Astra 28 or Utilsat 28.5 Eastern. Now a last trick. Um, sometimes it may happen that the angle formed by the by the bar here that's holding the LNB has been changed for some reason. So the LNB is not oriented in such a way that it can receive the signal from uh, reflected by by the dish. But what you can do in that case, you pull this a little bit back, so almost you have a straight uh, uh, an, an angle here of 90 degrees, uh, uh, and then you move, you incline your LNB, your dish so that to be oriented toward the soil. The ground. When you do that, normally the, the, the sound of your satellite receiver will become sharper if the angle is correct. If not, you have to change a little bit by binding it, the angle here, and you orient again your, uh, your uh, dish against the ground. And then if you see a change in the volume of the satellite finder, you are sure that your angle is correct. This is a tip. Uh, to know when you have uh, uh, something going wrong with your angle here. But normally it comes from a factory with the right angle. So you don't have to move this at all. 